Assalamu alaikum students i am your english teacher ms manoor khan today we will do english literature by the novel the adventures of tom sawyer you have done with six chapters and two parts of six chapters as well today we will read the third part of chapter 6 okay so let me open the chapter 6 and there is chapter 6 the name of chapter 6 is the return okay you have done with the first topic a strange funeral and with the second topic as well the trial okay now today the third topic begins here let me start it tom tells the truth the next morning all the village crowded into the court house this was the great day after a long wait the jury walked in and took their places a short time after that potter was brought in he looked pale and without hope he was made to sit everybody where everybody could stare at him injun joe was in court too the judge arrived and the court was re- ready to begin one man told the court that he had seen potter washing in the river on the night of the murder Another man proved that the knife had been found next to the dead body. A third man said that he had seen Potter with that knife and he knew it was Potter's knife. Potter's lawyer did not ask any questions and things looked very bad for the poor man. Then a voice said, "Call Thomas Sawyer." Every head in the courtroom turned to look at Tom as he made his way to the witness stand he saw on the bible to tell the truth next page porter's lawyer stood up and began to ask tom some questions thomas sawyer where were you on the 17th of june about the hour of midnight Tom looked quickly at Injun Joe's face and he could not speak. Everyone was listening breathlessly, but the words refused to come. After a few minutes, however, he managed to whisper in the graveyard, a little louder, please don't be afraid. In the graveyard, were you anywhere near Horse Williams' grave? Yes, sir. How near were you? As near as I am to you. Were you hidden or not? I was hidden where behind the trees near the grave was anyone with you yes sir i went there with wait wait a minute never mind telling us your friend's name name we will hear from him at the proper time did you carry anything with you tom did not want to answer speak up my boy what did you take there only a dead cat there was a little laughter at this which stopped as the judge raised his hand now my boy tell us everything that happened don't leave anything out and don't be afraid tom began slowly at first but as he went on he found could found he could speak more easily in a little while there was not a sound in the court room except the sound of his own voice Every eye was fixed on him as his audience listened to the terrible story. Tom did not Tom got to the part where the murder happened. I saw the doctor hit Muff Potter with the piece of wood. Muff Potter fell to the ground. Then Injun Joe picked up Muff Potter's knife and crash quick as lightning injun joe jumped through the window and he was gone so tom was hero once more he had saved muff potter's life tom felt happy during the day everyone was very kind to him and said nice things about him but his nights were terrible his dreams were full of injun joe it was no longer fun to go out at night poor huck felt frightened too tom had told the lawyer the whole story the night before the last day of the trial huck was afraid that if injun joe got to know about it he would be in great danger 
now this part of the chapter 6 is telling us about the truth which tom tells in the court room all of the village people were there to listen the tom's truth that what tom is going to tell in the court tom is standing as a witness in the court here and he saw on the bible to tell the truth then the process of asking questions was continued there a lawyer asked some questions related to the murder from the tom tom answered the lawyer's questions okay but tom was very afraid to answer he was not comfortable there because everyone was there to listen tom to listen the truth okay everyone was uh, everyone's eye was fixed on the tom that he will tell the truth and then tom tried his will and start telling the terrible story which happened the last night and then he tells to the uh, judge to the lawyer and the people sitting in the court room that what happened in the last at the last night he said the doctor hit the muff potter here with a piece of food and injun jo pick up muff potter's knife and he ran from there okay injun jo jumped to through the window and he ran ran from there and tom saved the life of muff potter theek hai and then he was treated well by the people of village because he saved the life of the muff potter he was so happy at that day but the last night was very terrible for him at the last here huck was huck was very afraid that he was think thinking that if injun jo get to know about all this the life of huck will be get in the danger okay so this will be the story this was the story and this all things happen in this part of chapter 6 read it very well and try to make the concept clear in in your brain and uh, the words which are underlined there make the meanings of these words and use them in this in your sentences as well in your literature copy okay thank you so much allah hafiz assalam alaikum